Welcome to my stretch and strength exercises for dancers class. I'm gonna start with a stretch and then we'll start moving and do some drills to improve the strengthening of your legs, your feet, your ankle, your core and your back and your arms and everything. So a full body workout with me today. My name is Larissa. I'm very excited to be part of this event and I hope you have a great time. So let's start laying down on the floor. We're going to start by holding your right leg above your chest. Stay there for me. And while you're stretching and warming up your back in this position, we're going to do eight circles with your foot. Two, outside, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to do eight circles inside. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna stretch my leg up, try to have my knee straight, flex your foot, and you can hold whenever it's easier for you. If you wanna pull a little bit harder, then you hold a bit higher. And if you want a little less, you hold a little bit lower. You know your limits, so make sure you respect your limits and slowly pull that leg towards you. Make sure your left leg is still bent on the floor. Hold that position. Make sure your foot is flexed. We're gonna breathe in and when we breathe out, we're gonna pull the leg towards your face a little bit more. We go. Nice, hold that position. And bend the leg on top of your left. Make sure there you're gonna pull underneath your leg and just hold that position for me. Make sure you breathe. Try to relax your shoulders, try to relax your neck, your head on the floor. We try, we, we want to stay in each position uh, around 30 seconds, yes? Nice. And relax on the floor. Change legs and we're going to repeat everything on the right leg. Circles outside. Here we go. We go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and inside one two three four five six seven eight we're gonna stretch up make sure your knees super straight hold whenever is easier for you stay there We're using all the songs from Brazilian singers, so all in Portuguese today. <laughs> With the Zouk rhythm, yes? <laughs> we're gonna breathe in, when we breathe out, we're gonna pull more. So let's go, we go. Nice, hold that position. Good, make sure you stretch every day, yeah? it's very important, especially if you're a dancer. Bend the leg on top and hold underneath your knee if you can. Make sure you open that knee so we can stretch our glutes. Pull, you know your limits, so pull as much as you can. This is a very nice stretch to begin your day or before you go to bed every night. So you, if you, even if you do like 20 minutes per day, that will be very, very important. It will help you a lot to not only improve your flexibility, but prevent from injuries. Yes, prevent your body from hurting. 
and relax on the floor keeping both feet on the floor open your arms by the side of your shoulder we're going to drop the legs to the right side and just relax my head is going to turn opposite way stay in that position close your eyes Bring the legs back to the center and we're going to do the same thing to the other side. Bring it back to the center and we're going to both uh, hold both legs above your chest. Stay there and while you're staying there, we're going to point our foot and we're going to just do this exercise. Have a look, toes up and then flex and then foot and point. Toes, flex, down, point. Okay, so let's just do that around 20 repetitions. We're going to wait a little bit so we can kind of follow this next song coming up and we can do this very quickly and make sure you point your foot very strong every time you go down, okay? The intention is to be able to strengthen your ankles and the top part of your foot, yes? Prepare, point your foot, six, seven, eight. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Here we go, keep going. Nine, ten, eleven. Don't forget to breathe. I think we have two more. I already lost count. <laughs> All right. Relax your arms on the floor one more time. You felt that little burn? It's good. Now drop your legs one more time to the right side and turn your head opposite way. Stay in that position. Make sure you relax your feet. Relax your legs on the floor. Try to relax your shoulders. You will feel a pull towards on your side, side of your leg and your upper body, okay? Close your eyes, stay there. And we're gonna now straight, that leg that is on top is gonna go straight and you're gonna flex your foot, but keep it on the floor, yes? And hold it with your right arm. Stay in that position a little longer. Breathe, relax, bring your feet together. Using the strength from your core, bring your legs up and all the way to the other side. And here. Turn your head the opposite way. And now you're gonna straight that leg on top. Flex the foot and hold. 
Try to keep your knee very straight. Try to flex that foot as much as you can. If you can lift higher, even better. If that's your limit, perfect, no problem, yes? Try every day you pull a little bit more. Yes, push yourself, go. If you feel weird, pain, uncomfortable, then just get rid of the, uh, get out of the position, relax, and try to start over, but then pu pushing yourself a little bit less, yes? Go slowly. And relax, bring the feet together, bring the legs above your chest one more time, bring both legs up, but keep your knees bent for me, point your foot, we're going to do eight circles outside, and then eight circles inside with your foot, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, inside, one, two, three, four, and inside we go, one, three, seven, Inside, one more time, last time, go. I know it's burning, but it's good. Try not to move your legs, only your ankles, only your foot. Five, six, ay, ay, seven, eight. Yes, shake it, shake it, feels good. Nice. Very nice, hold your legs above your chest one more time. We're doing good. We're gonna turn sideways and push yourself up. For me, sit up. And now we're gonna go into this position. In this position now, I want you to just roll your head down, relax your shoulder, relax upper body, relax your head, hands on the floor, relax your legs, just stretch here. Stay there for me. If this is a position that is difficult for you to reach, you can um, put your back against the wall to help you stay in this position. Or if it's still too hard, you can bend in both legs as well, okay? Relax your shoulders, relax your arms. And with your hands, if you can, walk forward for me and pull a little bit more. slowly the head is the last one to arrive make sure your upper body is up and straight we're gonna do this rolling down again but now try to have your knees straight and your foot flexed yes <laughs> 30 foot so we go and roll grab your foot if you can hold but if you cannot if it's too hard, you can always hold your legs so you can be here as long as you have your foot flexed for me very slowly nice okay we're gonna do this foot exercise in this position before we keep our stretching I would like you to turn your legs in this position turn out let me put this cable right here point your foot for me and what we're gonna do with the upper body straight I'm gonna have my hands on my uh, legs I'm gonna lift the leg as much as you can. So it could be very little or it could be higher. It's up to you, you tell me. So you go up, I'm gonna flex your foot, point my foot and go down. I go left, flex, point and down. So we're gonna alternate the legs, yes? Keeping the knees very straight, keeping your upper body, hold your core, engage the core, engage your back, make sure you can resist that position. I would prefer that you don't use the wall, but if it's too hard, you can 
put your back against the wall or even if you prefer you can start by using this position to help yes but I would like you to try as much as you can to hold okay so I know we'll be we have different levels of people watching and let's see how we go okay so we're just gonna wait in this next song All right, man. let's go prepare, five, six, seven, we go, one, two, three, and left, five, six, point, very strong, one, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, hold your core, keep your shoulders down, Keep going, don't give up, you can do it. Let's go, strong. Straight and knees stronger. Can we do two more? You can do it, let's go. Two more, two more, let's go. <laughs> Five, six, and stop. If you feel cramps, get out of the position. <laughs> Relax your muscle and get back to it. Yes, relax a little bit. We're gonna repeat, yeah? You can just roll your head down again if you want. Five, three, five, six, here we go. One, five, six, seven, eight. Go, point your foot, very strong. Think about the lines that you need for your dance, for your dance, social dance, performance, your classes. Mm. Strong. Two more, let's go, you can do it. Push it harder, push it harder. And five, six, seven, relax. Nice, have a drink. I'll give you 30 seconds. Bring your legs sideways, bend this leg, this arm go forward and we're gonna just stretch in this position. While our leg is relaxing. And roll up, roll forward. Roll up for me. Nice, change legs. And we're gonna go, this arm go right in front, this one go up. Make sure you open your chest, have the arm above your head. Relax the leg, just keep that arm there. Roll forward. And roll up. Very nice. Go into this frog position. Open the leg as much as you can and move, swing from side to side in this position. Try to stay in the middle. Well, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go into our lunge stretch. So I'm gonna have the right leg in front and the left back straight knee. I'm gonna push myself up as much as you can. Fix your hair. <laughs> if you can, keep this knee straight, 90 degrees on this leg against the floor, parallel foot, yeah? Now lift the arms in the fifth position like this. We're gonna breathe in. When you breathe out, you go back. Open your chest, look up. Go. 
Nice. But if this is too hard for you, oops, just hold the wall or stay here. Yeah, not a problem. You can stay holding as well. The idea is to be able to do this position, but if you can balance, then it's even better. Yeah, stay there. Put your knee on the floor now and push yourself back one more time. The idea is to really push your pelvis down. Yeah? We're gonna now try to put our head on the floor. I will bring both arms in front of my foot, so both hands in front. I'm gonna put my head on the floor. Stay there. And come up. If you can, bend that leg for me in the back. Hold it. Try to hold and pull a little bit more. But if, if this position is too hard, stay there one more time, yes? And just keep pushing your pelvis down. on the front, try to have a 90 degrees position and just roll, in, roll on top of that leg and just bend forward, drop forward here. The goal here is to stretch our glutes mainly, yeah? so make sure you really feel it on your right glute. Very nice. Get out of this position slowly, bring that leg in front, change legs. We're gonna start the same stretch that we just did, but all on the left leg. All right, so we're gonna do left leg. Same thing, lunge. Try to make, your, make sure your right knee is straight. We're going to lift our upper body, hold that balance, hold that core, straight that leg, stay there. And if you can, we're going to lift the arms in the fifth position, breathing, when you breathe out, go up, look up, open your chest. come back both arms go down there just put your knees down you can push one more time actually nice push that hip down yeah both arms in front we're gonna just bend put your head on the floor Try to breathe, don't forget. <laughs> Push harder, drop the hip. And now if you can, bend the leg and pull it. Try to touch your heel on your glute. Nice, stay there. Push a little bit more, go, pull, 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 and relax. Transfer the weight back, bend the leg in front, roll it on top of that right leg, 
and then just relax your upper body forward. Stay there. Don't forget to follow our YouTube page to Kadu and Larissa. We also on Instagram, Kadu and Larissa. Or you can just follow me as well, or you can follow everybody. Kadu and Larissa and Larissa. Follow me on Instagram. So you can join these classes with me live every Saturday. Nice. Come up. Bring the leg together. Relax forward one more time. Very nice. Turn face this way. We're going to open both legs as much as you can. Doesn't need to be too much. And walk forward like this with your hands. And just pull yourself down. Try to relax your head. Relax your shoulders and go. If you already reached that position very easily, go a little bit more. Pass. Yes. Stay there. This, this sequence of doing the lunges um, and now this uh, pushing a little bit forward on your second position as well, it's very helpful to uh, for you to achieve your full splits, yeah, as if you're a dancer and know a lot of the dancers have this goal to achieve the full split, so this stretch will definitely help you, okay? Come up, relax those legs, close, 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 very nice, okay? So, what we're gonna do now, we're gonna have, we're gonna use this band, if you don't have a band, that is not a problem, but if you have a band, I want you to put that band above your knees, we're gonna lay down and we're gonna start doing this exercise for our glutes to strengthen our hamstring and our glutes. Let's go. So I'm gonna lift the pelvis up. I'm gonna just drop my right, left, right, left four times. Let's do together. And then we do left. A, one, two, up, up. Right, left, right, left. Keep your knees separate. And now go from the left. Left down, right, left, down, and left. Nice. We go down both legs, go hips, both hips. <laughs> Don't touch the floor. And up. And down, down. Roll up. Engage. Squeeze the glutes. Go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now fast. I go down, down, up. Don't touch the floor. Don't give up. It's starting to burn. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going, five, six, seven, eight, and stop. Very nice, hold your legs on your chest. Nice, we're gonna take the band off now. So we can do our next exercise, which is gonna be mainly focus on your hamstring. Have a drink. Now for this next exercise, we're gonna use one leg up one leg bent, I'm going to point my foot and every time I lift my hip here, so if I go one, I flex and I point, I flex and I point without touching the floor, you ready? You breathe, let's go, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, change legs, and one, two. I think I alternated this foot position. <laughs> That's okay. And six. One more time, we're gonna change legs. Here we go, and one, two, three. Push, push, squeeze. <laughs> change one more time, go. 
go. Seven, last time, and eight, very nice, that burn, doesn't it? Hold your legs a little bit. Woo. Very nice, hamstrings. Breathe. I'm, I'm looking at my heartbeat here. Let's see if it's working. Mm, it's working. <laughs> Keep going here. Rest. Nice. We're going to roll up. And now we're going to get up. All right. So our next exercise, I would like to use this a resistance band. If you don't have, we're going to do an exercise for the calves and also for the shoulder blades and your shoulders, your back. If you don't have this therapy band, this exercise band, that's not a problem. You can order it online and grab it for the next time, or you can just do the part of the legs exercise and have your hands on the hips. Now, if you have a resistance band, I'd like you to put around your back, here on your waist, cross that, and make sure here you have your um, wrist connect to your uh, waist. Yes, just do this for me. Hold with the palm face up, hold the band, and now just open that band and close without opening your elbows. So your elbows need to be touching your waist the entire time. I want you to look this angle here. So you're gonna go squeeze the shoulder blade and come back. Squeeze and back, squeeze and back. At the same time that I'm doing this shoulder blade exercise, I'm going to have my feet in the first position, yes, and then every time I go up on releve, so making sure my knees is straight the entire time, I go super high, super high, make sure your heels are going towards the middle toe, up, hold, and down, and when I'm doing that, I am squeezing this shoulder blade, so I go up, and down. Concentrate so you can hold that balance. This is a full body workout, remember. Up and down. Yeah, you had a feeling? We're gonna do 15 repetitions, yes, with music together. Let's go. Five, six, seven, eight. Concentrate, engage the core. can do it. Keep going. Hold, oh, glutes, glutes. Woo. The more you do, the more tired you get, harder. Just one more. And relax. Woo. Cough, you felt the cough? Shake it. Have a drink. Woo. Where's my drink? My drink is here. More time. I think we can do ten more. Let's go. Five, six, seven, go. One, faster. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, yes, you can do it, good, very nice. Okay, so for this exercise now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna have the legs in second position, open there, uh, turn out, make sure you activate the inner thigh, your quad, and your glutes. Now, the core here, make sure your chest is open, shoulders down, hold your arms in front of your upper body here. I'm gonna do plie, and up. So just try that for me. So just do a few times, plie and up. And every time you go up all the way to stretch your, to straighten your knees, activate those muscles, yes? And squeeze the glutes, go. One and two, three, 
and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. Felt that? Now we're not gonna go up all the way. So this sequence, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go lift your heel on the right foot, bounce, and then plie, go up, and then lift the left, up, plie, up, right, up, plie, up, left, up, plie. Trying to hold your balance, make sure that every time you lift your heel, you go towards the middle toe. Yes, very important. Now you're gonna feel your calf, you're gonna feel your legs, you're gonna feel your glutes. You're gonna feel your full body doing this exercise. Let's go. With music. So with this song. Three, four, five. Have a look, have a look first. You're gonna go right, down, left, down, okay? You ready? Five. Let's do 16 times, yes? One, two, three. Four with me, five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, four. Three, four, five, six, hold it, seven, eight, eight more, let's go, breathe, hold your core, hold your core, hold your core, you can do it, don't give up, it's almost there, two more, seven, eight, and stop, very good, breathe, have a drink if you need to stretch more, your quads cool there. That's good, right? Yeah. Change legs. Nice. Have a drink. Now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna do lunges. I'm gonna go forward and I'm gonna come back. The goal here should go lunge and up, lunge and up, lunge and up, keep going, and I'm gonna change legs. We're gonna do only eight times per leg. We're gonna breathe and I'm gonna start over. So make sure every time, make sure every time you push yourself back, you go up and back, not just back. Up, hold that core, hold that back. This leg doesn't matter if it's 45 degrees or if it's 90, it's up to you. Make sure you straight here, have your knees straight and point your foot and hold that position. Now engage that glute to be able to hold that in that position. Arms in front of your body. Try your best to hold your balance, yes? Prepare, breathe, make sure you engage that core like we're talking about. Prepare. We're gonna have the arms here, parallel position, hold. Five, six, seven, go together. One, two, five, six, hold. Three, four, five, six, seven, last time, eight, and stop, very nice, relax, we're gonna do the other leg. Woo. I'm gonna do face you. Five. Oh, Six, seven, eight. Six, seven, eight. Make sure you're straight, both knees straight, straight. Use your glutes. Have a drink, rest a little bit. Let's repeat. Right leg. Five, six. Make sure your knee go in the same line as your toe. Go down, hold.
Last time. Oh, nice. If this is too hard, you can also just do lunge and just stay in that position. Yes? That's an alternative, yeah? Seven left, go. One, two, Woo. three. Hold yourself. Ugh. Getting tired is harder. Five, six, Woo. seven, Ugh. eight. Woo. Good job, guys. Okay, have a drink. Okay, everyone, now to finalize our full body workout for dancers and non dancers, too, we're gonna do a series of abs on the floor and push ups. So, we're gonna start very basic. You've done this before, the normal crunches here. Make sure you don't touch your shoulders back on the floor, it's just up and down. Make sure you breathe out every time you go up. Create that smile on your belly. We're gonna do eight crunches this way. And I'm going to roll to my right and do planks. Eight counts, roll back, crunches with the legs up, roll to the left. Oh, my microphone is going to kill it. And then, if you can, we do uh, push ups. Yes? And then we roll it back and we start all over. Now, the crunches you can do any variation you like is up to you. Yes, as long as you don't stop. Because the main goal is to do this entire song non-stop. So you do whatever variation you want. You ready? All right, let's go. Prepare on the floor. Five and six and five, six, seven, eight, slow. One, two, two, three, four, five. Roll to the plank. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and one. Let's roll it. Two push ups. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, and roll. One, two. Don't forget to breathe. Roll to plank. Go, plank. Five, six, seven. Roll, abs. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, two the push ups. One, two, abs, two, three. Don't give up. Let's go. Go. I'm going to do plank sideways, actually. Hold. Hold, five, six, seven, don't give up and go, breathe. Don't forget to breathe and play, two, three, four, five, Abs, go. Almost done. Nice. 
sit and rest. And you're done. <laughs> Get out. Okay, guys. I hope you had a good time. Hold on. I hope you had a good time doing this full body workout with me with a lot of technique for dancers and then if you're not a dancer you can still work on all these exercises are going to be great to strengthening your legs your core your upper body your arms yes so make sure you get the discipline of working out especially at this time that we are home so you have time and you should be working out every day so if you want to follow me Larissa.tayani and Larissa.tayani on Instagram and Facebook and I'm offering this live class as well there so if you want to join the online classes so you can learn more exercises like this in depth like more technique details go to kadularissaonline.com kadularissaonline.com all right and sign up for our online classes